After over 1500 kc with no enhanced seed, this is how Defy currently feels. But Defy isn't the only one on the hunt for that seed. This man at 363kc already has the pet, but not that sweet, sweet seed. Are you right, Drake? Let's find out. Oh, I'm, I'm done. I'm done. So some very colourful language and it sounded so good with that beautiful accent. Getting another roll of the pet without the enhance, but do not worry because Kane got a back-to-back. The gauntlet sending RuneScape players insane since the 25th of July 2019, but I do have a nice clip from Defy for today. Oh, we got! Oh, we got! I jump it! I jump it! I've got it! I have it! Oh! Oh! The grind the entire community has been following at 1584kc with three rolls of the pet and a total of 73, yes that's right, 73 other crystals obtained. Defy can now leave the red prison and I am super happy about that because I was sick of seeing him there. He ran straight over to make the beautiful Bofa. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. I'm so overwhelmed, dude. I feel so good right now, dude. I I feel incredible, dude. But it seems all of the corrupted gauntlet content was happening today. Foe literally went there on one of his old Iron Mans just to teach someone how you do a CG run. CG cozy chat. Yeah, CG's nice, man. This is why I look forward to this on a hardcore. You know, we use one, two, three, four food there, and uh, get an easy kill. Oh my gosh. I just got a bofa from explaining that. <laughs> I do one CG to explain how to do CG on a hardcore. I get a bofa. That green log's gauntlet for me. The beautiful green log obtained just from helping out a buddy getting some of the best karma in the game. Too bad it wasn't on his farmer's account that I don't think is quite ready for a CG run yet. But his farmer's account certainly is ready for the Abyssal Demons. He's already received one whip and the Abyssal Dagger. Yes! 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 Ah, oh, we got another one at the end, dudes. At 2,100kc, still under drop rate for the whip, so I think we're going to see another few coming in shortly. G'day, legends. We upload every single day, and half of you who watch aren't even subscribed, so make sure to hit that sub button. I can't believe there are still things popping up in RuneScape that I've never seen before, and I certainly never thought that I would actually see this. The community is going absolutely crazy over this Reddit post, and there are memes popping up everywhere. Basically, this dude made a post saying the grind don't stop in brackets unless your grandpa and he is literally at his grandpa's funeral but he just had to get those sweet sweet xp gain so he's doing a sneaky birdhouse run while at the wake and can you believe the top comment is comedy is the best way to get over grief laugh and have fun your grandpa should play dead man mode and someone said it looks like he did play it but he won't be making it to the finale and also an mvp in the comments said be respectful bro at least train prayer this is something i would certainly never do at a fair family member's funeral and half the community is having a bit of a laugh while the other half are saying how super insensitive it is. You guys have been going absolutely crazy for the amazing products that GamerSups have to offer and today I'm going to be giving you guys the chance to win some freebies. But before we get to that, have a look what they sent me. They have this new polarized shaker which is my absolute favorite. It just looks so cool. But if you want that one, you'll have to wait till they restock. Their products are literally flying out the door. They have so many new flavors and new shakers cups coming in every single week so make sure you check them out but just make sure you use code BE to get you the very nice 10% discount but if you would like to get some for absolutely free I'm gonna be hiding one $20 code on this video but I'm also going to be commenting two $40 codes in the comment to this video anytime today and one $20 code so you'll have to be checking the comments at the right time it may even be a reply to a comment you'll just have
have to wait and see. But if you don't want to wait and want to get a tub for yourself right now, use code BEHE. We've had a lot of Kings of Clue scrolls, but it seems Moni Moo is slowly becoming the absolute queen of the Clue scroll content. <gasps> okay, I got some gilded plate legs. That is so nice. I'm happy. I love this. The beautiful gilded plate legs after almost 200 master clues. The only thing more beautiful than that is seeing a bot farm. Holy. <laughs> How many bots are there? So apparently Ox just randomly stumbled across these bots in the desert and they were all there buying chalk ice from that little stall. And good old Rock's chalk box, one of the best stalls in RuneScape, sells chalk ice for 30 GP a piece and you can sell it for 132 GP at the GE. And he also sells chocolate bars for 10 GP, which you can sell for 37 GP, making a grand total profit of 27 GP. But the chalk ice is getting 100 GP profit per one, meaning every time these bots teleport in, they're only making about 2,500 GP, but I guess if they're on repeat and never getting banned, it could start to add up. Anyway, a very unique and weird little bot farm I certainly haven't seen before. Skill Specs wanted something spicy, but I don't think he could handle the heat of this succulent meal. That could have been spicy. That could have been spicy too. Hit the vengeance, I don't give a flying f Dying on my heart cry, man. Completed. Was it? What exactly was good about that, bro? Send a full HP f Absolute dagger and just clap my cheeks, bro. And it's a good fight. Man! And with all these new ways to spec people out the game, it just means more ways to see skill specs die in rage. Let me take you all back about 25 days ago during John Subathon, he ended up alking his ancestral robe bottoms, then went on on his very next raid to send a big mega scale, but unfortunately got that exact drop he needs on his main account. Well, his Subathon is still going he's about 31 days deep and he did get an item on his iron man this time no f oh, bro <laughs> bro i just out that on the subathon there is absolutely no way i pulled this after alking it tau is an absolute magnet for the ancestral robe bottoms at the moment to make his mage setup very mismatched to go perfectly with his range setup of missouri armadillo and green gilded dehyde and his character is just one of the worst i've ever seen but while we are giving out the rips we better switch over to jiminy cricket who is on his hardcore iron man attempting bandos and unfortunately for this scythe wielding hard Core. He got taken out the game because he was sitting on some very low HP while trying to flick all the minions. And that just seems like a massive risk when he could have just ate up. He literally had a full invent of anglers. And I kid you not, I asked this man to send over all his best items and he literally sent me an empty invent except for the scythe and the ring of endurance. But it was still a very respectable account. 2047 total level and any account in my opinion that's a hardcore and has gone through TOB has to be respected. But something that is not very respected in our community is baiting people out to multi. Bruh. No way. No way. Dude, I knew that was a player. And it looked like that was Rot indeed once again who ended up taking this man out for his Karassi. After 5 hours and 46 minutes, ED Scapers got to the end of this massive mega scale, but will it be worth it? Yeah! And I'm not kidding, after seeing that that was a purple light, the man milked it for an extremely long time, but it all came down to this. Not quite the twisted bee that he was after. Maybe a bit of karma for milking it longer than I milk myself. Probably another thing you've never seen. RuneScape at a music concert. Uh, anyone f***ing RuneScape as well? Good So this musician was literally rocking out with a little bit of Oda Block PK montage in the background for everyone to join. It can't get any better than that. Do not let Tuck Shop deceive you. As you can see in the chat, he has died a total of six times during this 425 TOA run. And maybe that's the reason his friend got the purple. What are we getting? 
Oh, oh shit. Sure. No, no, actual what? shadow, dude. Let's go, dude. No. <laughs> Where's Adam? Let's go. A very nice split. Iron Munted wasn't very happy. It was on his MVP. But I think the guy who got the drop is muted because he was simply dancing around, not typing anything in the chat. But all you guys need to do is type in the comments and drop a like on this video for me to love you forever.